news tonight here at home. An Amber Alert for two children who police say were kidnapped by their own father. This is Sarah and Patrick Wynn. They were taken from their foster home late this afternoon in Braintree. And that's where Bobby Sisk joins us live tonight. Bobby? Jonathan and Lisa, this is now an Amber Alert, Amber Alert broadcasting across the country. That's important because Braintree police here tell me this father has ties to Nevada and to Utah. They're not sure where he's going, but it's how he took off that has them worried. It is quiet now on the Braintree Street where 10 year old Sarah and 8 year old Patrick Wynn lived with their foster family. He forcibly removed one child, the son, from the house and he um, ordered his daughter to get in the car with him as well and she complied. Around 4.30 Monday afternoon, Police Chief Russell Jenkins says 54 year old John Lockwood barged into the home. The foster mother struggled to hang on to Patrick but couldn't. And he. Uh, uh, pushed her out of the way as she tried to uh, get the chill and to hide from him. Neighbors heard the commotion. One chased Lockwood's vehicle down the street. We were aware that this might happen, quite frankly, uh, and uh, there was some there was some talk this might occur. The chief would not elaborate on what officers knew, but says Lockwood did have supervised visitation and met with the children along with DCF earlier in the day, possibly in Weymouth. He has no idea how he found the Braintree address or what he's planning now. They're being told by a family member that he's not a risk to the kids, but we don't know that for a fact, no. Okay, take a look at your screen right now. Lockwood's driving a 1995 Brown BMW 525i with this plate, 478RF8. We did find out tonight he'd been staying at the America's Best Value Inn in Foxborough. A clerk there told us, though, he checked out earlier today. If you see him or those children or that car, you're asked to call Braintree Police. I'm live in Braintree tonight. Bobby Sisk, WBZ News. Back to you. Bobby, thank you.